Good Take morning, up. friends, and welcome back to the Beef Homestead. Who's talking on the two way? Yes, okay. All right, so. Sorry about the bumpy ride, guys. Two seconds and we'll be on the road. All we really have to uh, share with you today is oh, these my things are Dorpers. Um, oh, yeah, I don't even know what to say. So, so sick of it. As you would have seen by our previous videos, multiple videos. Um, but this has been an ongoing issue for since we got them, really. We had a little um, flock of daubers that never got out. They were awesome, they were well behaved, never got out. But in saying that, this is a particularly tough year. Um, yeah, it's dry. It's very, very hot. You dry it up quick. And even though they have everything they need and there's still plenty of feed in the paddock, they all grass is always greener, right? Even though it's not green, bright, dry and brown. Bright, yeah, bright yellow. Bright yellow. Um, so, we are going to add to the regime. First we have to go get them. <laughs> and then we're going to add to the regime by adding some more minerals to their diet and that sort of thing. We're gonna go get these sheep in. Uh, we thought we got rid of the main problem, which was the ram, and he actually was a problem. But we still have some troubled, troubled ones. Same 18 that keep getting out. So we think we're just gonna put them in a different paddock and slowly eat them, because what else can we do? No. So let's see where this takes us. And uh, then we gotta go home and get back into your homeschool lessons, because, um, homeschooling now. Grace decided she just did not want to do school anymore. Doing it until I'm 100. You don't need to go to school until you're 100, especially if you're homeschooled. Why don't you like school, Grace? Because there's so many nasty people. Including so. teachers. That's why I didn't go back. No, teachers. My teachers are fine. Grace's it's teachers were people. lovely. And Grace's teachers were lovely and sweet. Yeah. Um, but it wasn't the teachers that was her problem. What was the problem, honey? The um, kids, girls. Yeah, the children are so mean-spirited these days. Um, and and cruel and unkind. And I, I was, wasn't like that when I was in school. I actually still am in, in contact with some of my primary school friends. And I love them dearly. But yeah, no, it's definitely been an issue for Grace. Um, so yeah, do you, do you enjoy homeschool? We did last week, we did a whole week's worth of um, schooling. So I'll, be, I'll be done in no time. In, in two days, so she's really loving it. We did some lovely okay. Aboriginal art, which um, so we, we learnt about how they did the Aboriginal paintings and that sort of stuff. And then we created one, didn't we? Or you created one, I didn't even touch it. So I'll put pictures of that in the video somewhere. Um, but yeah, let's get these sheep in and then get home to the homeschooling. Homeschooling! Yep. She thinks you're her baby too. <laughs> So <laughs> we're in our neighbor's place and they to, they have been so beautiful about this. They're so patient. Uh, they don't have livestock, so this must be very frustrating for them. They do have a beautiful set of yards behind us here, which is so handy because they managed to get one of them trapped in the yards. You can see her down there, she's that so culprit. She's being a brat. She's one of the worst ones. She's got a dot on her shoulder, so she's very recognizable to us. Uh, now these other ones here, I think it's four or five of them, five, something like that. Five. The Ray boys Ray. are on, mm. what, Alex is on Noah's bike and Brock is driving. Ray. And the plan is, I'll turn you guys around and show you, it's very bright. Um, they're going to push them to that fence along. and gently work them along they're going to follow and straight into this yard Unless they follow that where track, they can be put with her and then we can load them up onto a trailer. And drive them home and put them in a more secure paddock. Yes, love. What if they follow that track? Uh, no, well, that's what we're here for on foot because we'll see them and we'll head that way. I'll try to run. 
Yeah. So nah, you don't need to run. Oh, yeah. I always wear my... No, 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 you wear the hat. No, yeah, you wear the I hat. Put the hat on. Okay. Um, yeah, I normally wear my hat because it's so good at blocking the sun and I can't safe. believe I forgot it. I never forget my hat. But anyway, let's uh, switch on and keep an eye on what's going, going on here and get these sheep. I can see them. That's four. Hey? Oh, I knew there was five. I was like, hang on, that's four. <laughs> yeah, I was like, wait, that one of them's gone. That's the last thing. I'm like, I thought there was one. Yeah, I'll go. Oh, we need to lock them in a smaller area. Look at lock them in the race here. In where? Grace, back up. Grace, back up. Grace, back up on this way. Whoa! Oh, that one just hopped out. They need a race. They need a race. Oh, no. Yeah, yeah. Go around, Grace. Go around. Go around. Go around, Grace. Go around, Grace. She needs to be in a race. They need a thin spot. Grace, go around. Did you just see what that one just did? Like Bambi. Wait a minute, in, the, we, in a centre pen. If we jam them, if we jam them, you go below the nose. No, where they can't do a run up, that's what I'm saying. Nose to ass. In this spot here. We, well, this is over. No, no, what do you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay, I gotcha. I got it. Close that up. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa. No pressure, she's gonna go over. Yep, now put her in here. She's going in the freezer for sure. That is not, Mum, that is not Raven. Maybe, maybe that's why they went to the markets. That's why they went to the markets, I agree. That's why they were cheap. And they're part gazelle. That's not Raven, Mum. No, that's not Raven. They're pre Welcome back to Honeybee Farmstead. Well, we're not even on Honeybee Farmstead. <laughs> we're on Puds Farmstead. Uh, Dorper Cross Gazelle. Yeah, Dorper Cross Gazelle. Springbok. Stay there, six. Yeah, I know. Well, that's why I want to no. sort of open up that race and you just push them into here. You can't get through there, my love. Imagine what it does, it's just going to jump, it's just going to jump down that race too. If we squeeze them up tight, they're not going to jump. Very, uh, no, jump it, jump it. No, don't, jump Just wait, just wait. That's it. Give them a second to think. If you don't put pressure on, they don't. There we go. What do you mean the gate shut? Oh, it blew. It blew closed. Don't let her go over. No push. Stop! And here's the other lot. These are the other culprits. And we have run across paddocks and fields and set up our yards to be able to capture them. Trying to work them along the fence now. These guys can jump and clear fences. 
that's it. I know. This is the gap they're going to want to... Alex, Alex, Alex. Turn them back around. That's it. That's it. Ah, wave. Be big and loud, Grace. Big and loud. Wave. Yeah, I know. So, yeah, we didn't catch those sheep. They joined the flock again. And now we know why they were for sale at the yards because I would have absolutely cut them off too and sold them, which is what they did. So we're yeah. not going to bother doing that. We're just going to eat them and enjoy every mouthful because they have given us some grief today. <laughs> so we're going to go back now. And I've been going to stitch. Put the trailer on with the cage and come back and pick up the sheep we did manage to catch in the sheep yards. That is a win because they're the first ones going in the cool room. Well, they're and the um, can I have the whole plan? Yeah, yeah. I, I reckon that we um do the whole lamb on a spit and just enjoy it. Yeah. No, like I mean about the actual lamb. Oh, you pretty chitty bang bang. <laughs> Mum, I'm talking about the actual bang. Um, what do you mean? The actual lamb. Eat it. Yeah, yeah. We, I think. Well, you will no, not I be able. Actual land, actual you won't be land. able to eat it all. Anyway, so we're going to go do that and tell you what, we're going to rethink the type of sheep we're keeping because those ones went clear over the fence. They didn't even slide under. When they couldn't get under, they just launched it like they're part springbok, part door buck. Like, you know those like stuck pens? Deer. You know those duck pens? It'd be nice if they tasted like venison. Oof. Yum. I should have tried that. We don't know. Because I, I haven't had venison in a long time. I haven't had venison either, ever. I know, we have to get some. You know down in Willingham. Uh, do, do you reckon Dad would let us keep deer after this? <laughs> He'd be like, in a small bed. I can't say it on this channel because we don't, we try not to swear in case there's young, young ears listening. But um, he would be saying a lot of expletives uh, if we decided to ask him to keep deer. Hey, I'm well, watching. I know we just talked about his back, eh? <laughs> yeah, Can't right. Home from a swing at work. Next minute, <laughs> Hood's on the phone, there's some deer in my yard. <laughs> <laughs> We're not doing that. We're not doing that. No, but if we make oh. a little contained yard for him. No. We're just not doing it. I'll oh. buy venison from someone who's crazy enough to keep them. I'll, um, or trade. I'll go hunt them. I know where they are. Let's get cows for sheep. Yeah, let's switch cows, sheep for cows. That's I love it because none of our cow. Oh, I'm not even gonna say that out loud. No, no. I'm not even gonna tempt fate. Right, so all the cows are young pigeons. While we bounce, yeah, we've eaten them. Yep. Harvey, Woody. So far, that's it. Yeah, I but feel like probably gonna be Tom. Uh, yeah, next. I feel like it would be Tom next. Good guess because he's the half meat breed. And plus, um, and Tom. Tom ah. T Bone and then Woody. Yeah, but T Bone doesn't get out. <laughs> T-Bone leads them into Flora. We've yeah, already so eaten Woody. You mean Tom? No, Tom. Like, Tom is Anyway, Tom got we digress. Yeah. We are... Uh, look, I'll turn you guys around. Excuse the very extremely dirty windscreen. Extremely This is the dirty... Um, this is the dirty paddock basher car, and the windscreen never gets a clean. Um, <laughs> and, yeah. You'll see that uh, Mr. Honeybee is not wearing a helmet. Yeah, look at me real quick. I'm telling you right now. Yeah, one of them kids out there that are uh, watching this. Do not do what he does. Don't do what he does because there's a few You'll times where I've thought he's come dead. off. And um, if you come off, like even a little slide out and fall, you can cast yourself the whole lot, crack your head open the whole lot. Break your neck. Um, I'll tell you a bit of a story. Noel was actually riding this bike and he hit a big rut and he got flown into the air about two minutes high. Um, hit the deck and I thought he was dead until I got down there and if he wasn't wearing his helmet he would have died so even just, he says that eh? yeah just keep that in mind if you're ever gonna ride any motorized anything wear a helmet even ride it wear a helmet
helmet, knee pads, long pants, boots. Because even if you're riding long and a rock Snake. picks up, pops your um, foot open. I've had that happen to my croc. Not my foot. Snake. I was wearing crocs and yeah, it just popped open. So make sure you uh, wear safety gear. Please. Yeah, so there we go. We're backtracking. Oh, look at this bit, Hold of, on. bit of bird poo on the... Hold on. <laughs> We're backtracking all the way back. We've got to go. Oh, more tin to flip. No, that's concrete. It's oh. concrete pad. <laughs> but you don't have tin flip back over there. Um, yeah, so we're heading back to ours and we will catch you up on what the goes is when we get there. Alright, so we're back at the grind. These mongrels. So we're going to probably open up this gate, put this race on. Straighten the trailer. It's a good idea, isn't it? Brock, I might need you to drop the tailgate. You. Up high. Yeah. All right, now, Brock, push that gate all the way around. Yep, like that. We're gonna have to have someone stand there. Do you want me to push them and you watch the gates and stuff, Ooh. Alex? Hey. Do you want me to t turn them and you watch the gate, watch the gate and stuff with Brock? Hey, 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 hey! Hey! Oh, you mean they're dumb? They're pretty dumb. Grace, hop down. Oh, pretty dumb. All right. So my camera went flat yesterday during pulling the sheep onto the trailer but it was all pretty much of a non-event um, make sure this is shut um, I wanted to give you guys a little bit of an update what we decided to do oh look the kids are getting the calves alrighty oh no what's happened to your halter something's broken on her halter Lola's halter She'll come in, I'll feed her. All right, so this is the part of the night. We haven't um, milked for like a week because we've had plenty of milk and it's all been lovely and fresh and delicious. He's a brat, that one. Are you ready, Gracie? Where's Teddy? Go around that one. Here we go, focus. Your oh, it's just <laughs> unclipped. Get here. We go. Who's that? Peanut. Here we go. Wait, Jackson. Wait. Get that's it, Gracie. Open it up. That's it. Open it up. Noah, focus. Jackson, watching. Come on. You know the drill. It's been about a week. Watch him. Watch him. Watch him. Watch his head. Go. Turn him back around. Mina, pull her in. Pull her in, that's it. Come on. Shh. Go behind, yep. Peanut. What about Peanut? Go, go, go. Shh, shh, shh. No, we don't use her as a herding dog. She's a protection dog. Come on. Come on, buddy. Come on. Watch. What happened to his back? Who's hurt his back? He does that to climb through fences. <laughs> With his mother, who's a fence jumper from way back. Come here. Hey ladies, we like to give them a break. Here we go, Peanut. Peanut. If you could get up next to her. Hey, wait, if you, wait, 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 wait. 
Come around, run around. Watch her, watch her. That's it, Peanut. Good job, Mina. Mina, you plastic bag out of her mouth. Who? No, that's no, not I put those Hello, my sweet. Yeah, but they this breed of jersey just stays nicer and more covered. Whereas this one seems to be just skinny all the time. Alrighty. So, that job's done. Make sure their food thing's full and their water. Um, so, the update on the sheep is, like I said to you guys earlier um, in the video, these sheep are being kept and they're just going in the cool room. We're not even putting them back in the paddock. We don't want to risk our lovely relationship with our neighbour who's been wonderful about it. Um, hi Heidi. They, they would have seen her. So we've got the kind of like a feedlot where all this hay. Yeah, she's like a springbok, isn't she? Yep. Now I want you to go in there and undo that. Slide it along because you need to clean out his poops and give him a feed. So we go in here. We sort out a heap of hay for everyone. The sheep have eaten heaps. And we wormed them before we put them in here because we don't know what they were, um, you know, having contact with while they were out. Now it's just to... That's it. Cinnamon can go too. Yep, good job. So we're pushing out the, the ones that are not growing babies or feeding babies. And we're making sure that we give plenty of hay to the ones that are producing milk and feeding babies. So we're just going to do that now. And then, uh, yeah, that's about it for now. We did not catch the other lot, but... But as soon as we do, they just tried to leap over. As soon as we catch the other lot, we'll be worming them and putting them in here with this lot to go in the fridge. There's my milk mamas and the sheep that we've all been fed with the oat and hay. What? Hold your horses. Ah, hold your horses or Hey soldier, why the long face? Uh, uh. You go in there every day, don't you, Grace, and clean his poops up? Yep. We collect it for the garden. We'll try to do some training with him tomorrow. We do well, this is part of his training, just getting used to you being around him. Yeah, he's starting to like walk around me, but like not that much. Hey big boy. Hey soldier. Hey soldier. Good boy, turning your bum to us all. Yeah, all that beautiful poop we take to the garden. Look at that, what a happy sight. Happily munching cows. Happy, happy. Happy, happy munching cows. Yeah. Cinnamon was jumping fences to try to get in here. Yeah, I know, she's a brat. Did you chain it shut? What? Oh, I think, I think no, Jackson shut it. Is that fence over there? Oh no, Cinnamon's gonna get into the orchard. We didn't even think about that. Let's put up some Come mesh. Bread, Just take the bread out then. Right. Yeah, We're going to go up and we'll put some mesh there to stop her getting in. Yeah, because every time she's a brat. Here, she's always in there. She's rat bag. You know what she's eating? The malt. What's it called? The hay. Oh, lupin malt. Yeah. That makes sense. But she's got lots of food here. <laughs> yeah, nice. So there you go. There's our latest dramas with sheep. sheep. Um, we are still working on it, but at this point we're like more interested in just getting rid of the problems rather than keeping it going. How's homeschool going? Great. She loves it's it. better than school school. Yeah, way better. Like, so um, I think we've had five solid days at school and she's done two weeks worth of work. Four so days. I counted. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then Monday, Tuesday. You better go back to homeschool. <laughs> Can't even count. Um, yeah, so it's, it's great. We've done some art and some cooking, and we're going to go over and preg test Ali and Paul's um, Sadie. Tomorrow. Because we're probably getting um, Jetson back. Wait, aren't we getting got, um, fish tomorrow? Oh, yeah, we've got to pick up fish for the aquaponics, but that'll be in another video. If you like this video and you haven't already, please Subscribe. consider subscribing because it like, helps us out. Share and comment. 
it helps us out. In order to subscribe, you need to be signed into your Google account um, to do YouTube. Hey, They're just changing positions. Why are the long faces? Anyway, um, yeah, so please hit the subscribe button. It helps us out heaps. Um, and we, yeah, we're trying to do this so that I can give up my job and do this full time. No, we need the money. No, <laughs> anyway. Um, Thank you so much for joining us. We really appreciate you being here and all your lovely support and beautiful comments. Keep it up, guys. It means the world to us. And until the next video, take care of each other and bye for now.